is up everyone welcome back to my channel and for today's video I'm going to be sharing my beauty con haul with you guys I did go to beauty con LA two weekends ago my sister and I both went and we had an absolute amazing time got to do some shopping um, check out different brands walk around booths listen to music meet influencers we got to meet Patrick Starr which was amazing he's so freaking cool it was just such a good time overall. We had such a blast. So the tickets that we did purchase for BeautyCon was the hauler package. And what came with that package was you were able to get in two hours prior to BeautyCon opening to general public. So we were able to get in at 10 a.m. and general public were, was able to walk in by 12 noon. And then we were also gifted the BeautyCon bag that had a whole bunch of goodies in it, which I really wasn't expecting much because, I mean, it was just, I don't know, maybe a few freebies here and there, but literally they filled that thing to the brim. Let me go ahead and show you because this thing is seriously heavy. Like, look at this thing. It is so big. It's like bigger than my head. It's like five times the size of my head literally filled to the brim like when they were handing these out I was like oh my gosh this bag is definitely worth what we paid for the most that I've done is just unzip it open and look inside have a lot to show you because with within this haul I also have a bunch of um, free things that I got throughout a bunch of the booths that we went to and then I also bought a few things as well. I'm gonna quickly just go through it just so we can both not sit here and be bored which I don't think it could get boring because we're both here for beauty and makeup and all all things like that so it shouldn't be boring but I don't know I don't want to make this video too too long. The first thing I'm pulling out is a um, opulent eye Laura Luxe lashes these are super pretty. Creme Shop Blender, Makeup Blender, Sponge Blender, whatever you want to call it. Spongeal Honey Blossom. This is a, a exfoliating sponge. The Wet Wild Highlighting Powder. Ooh, I have not tried these yet, and I've been wanting to try that, so I'm excited about that. Derma Doctor KP Duty Moisturizing for Dry Skin. We also got this little lanyard these duo chapsticks and I did get some freebies from them so they must have stuck more in here and like there's another one where you can just like mix and match different chapsticks so that's cool a Hikari Island Glow blush looks like cherry red cherry lashes so we got some red cherry lashes in Stevie also got some um, eyelash adhesive and an eyelash applicator Oh, that's cool. This is so cute. It came in a little bag like this. Rimmel Mascara. Revolution Shake Shake Technology. For clump, clump free volume. I don't know. Is it making noise? I don't know. Apparently you shake it and it doesn't clump. What is this? Derma Blend Loose Setting Powder. Can always have that. Cream Shop Wake Up Skin Mask. Oh, that's cute with a little raccoon on there. Oh, and then they're handing out these little bracelets as we walked in. I just like threw it in this bag because I didn't know where to put it, but cute. They also passed out these little, what is this, Tarte Lip Surgeons. They passed this out as we're walking in as well, which that's a full-size Tarte product. Nature Republic. So it looks like there's a sheet mask in here and some other little skincare samples. Ooh, I need one of these. It's a little straightener, heat resistant thing where you can just lay it all out so it doesn't burn your counter. The Beauty Crop. So this is a matte liquid lipstick. I've never heard of this brand. Let me just open it up real quick and take a look at what shade this is. Ooh, look at that. Yeah, that's pretty. Also got a Passion Planner. Oh, that's cute. Especially with this next school year coming up. My daughter's starting school, so this is definitely something that I'm going to need to plan. I like, I prefer writing stuff down versus putting it in my phone. Liquid Lipstick in two shades. Exposed and Bare. We also got um, Luxie Eye Essential Brush Set. Cute, which... My sister almost bought, but she was super happy that she ended up not buying it because it was in her bag. Garnier Micellar Makeup Removing Towelettes. Love the micellar water. Also got some Cantu Shea Butter. Rye Co-Wash. 
part dry shampoo. Nice. Definitely going to be using that. Um, Anti-frizz spray. Cots healthier sunscreen so we got some sunscreen samples in here which I have tried their brand I definitely like their brand leave-in conditioner coconut shea redken diamond oil glow dry shampoo and conditioner you guys dang oh cute little lip smacker my daughter actually has the Minnie Mouse one because I won a little uh, Minnie Mouse one when you spin the wheel so I'll probably give her this one too Total Tease Mascara by CoverGirl. Everything's falling. Um, Sweet Spot. What is that? Gentle Wash. Oh, another Duo Chapstick. A wet brush, which I opened up because it was at the top of my bag. And uh, we were at our Airbnb staying, and I ended up finding a wet brush because I was looking for a brush. My sister told me there's a brush in the bag somewhere, so I went to go hunt for it. Ooh, another Wet n Wild highlighter. The Outrageous Lashes. Two Step Serum. Definitely gonna try that out. What is, oh, you guys, seriously? I got the Neutrogena Light Therapy Acne Mask, and then I also got the Light Therapy Acne Spot Treatment. They stuck this in the bag. Holy crap. Um, if you guys wanna see a video on this or any of the products that I've mentioned, let me know. I'm excited about this. Holy crap. Here's more Duo Chapsticks. How does this work? I don't know how, oh, it clips in just like that. Cute. Oh, look at the little dollar sign pin. Pop Beauty Eyeliner. BNC Skin Tight Clearing Cleanser. Pixie by Petra Eyeliner. Chapstick Total Hydration Lip Scrub. I did not know that Chapstick made lip scrubs now. Ugh. Ooh, this is cute. Zoella Blissful Mist Perfume in a solid fragrance. That's different. I've never seen anything like a perfume in a solid little container. We love makeup. Look at that cute little compact. So cute. Slope and Glory Shower Gel. Infinite Paints. L'Oreal Mattes. Got a little lippy. This is really pretty. Oh yeah. That's definitely nude. Definitely nude. <laughs> um, Neutrogena Hydro Boost Hydrating Lip Treatment, which I did not know they had, so I'm very interested in trying that out because my lips have been feeling dry lately. Okay, so this is the Real Her brand moisturizing lipstick. I define myself beauty, which I have a lipstick from them because they were giving out samples too. Ooh, Real Techniques Makeup Sponge, and it has a little sponge holder. How cute. Revlon Ultra HD Matte Lip Color, which this one's super cute too. Metallic Matte, pretty nude color. Can't go wrong with nude, right? They gave me a Juicy Couture perfume. This one is in Glace. Viva La Juicy. Got Glace. I have not smelled this one. I don't think I've smelled this one before, so I'm interested in seeing how that is. Laneige Moisturizing Cream for normal to dry skin, which that will work for me. Lime Crime Lippy and Riley. Ooh, I like that color. I'm excited to try this out. Lip Balm, the brand Hello, and this is Extra Whitening Fluoride Toothpaste. J Cat's Matte Lipstick in Am I Ready? Looks like a really pretty pink. Crystal BB Cream, Long Shining Covering Makeup, SPF 37. And it's a blemish balm, so this is gonna be interesting to try out as well. Also got the Nia Kio. Um, Kenyan Coffee Lip Polish, which I have tried some of their products before, and they have good stuff. Holy masks. Okay, so, um, we have got a few masks. We've got Peach Slices. I got entered in a giveaway from, um, the Peach Slices booth, and I ended up winning some more masks. So I am super excited about that. I think I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some of those masks in a giveaway that I want to do for you guys once I reach 10,000 subscribers. So once I reach 10,000, we're doing a giveaway and I'm giving away a bunch of stuff. I've been collecting things for a while now just for that giveaway. So I'm probably going to include some of those masks in there. This, this is um, Aunt Jackie's Curl and Coils Hair Therapy Masks. Um, got some Acne Spot Dots, which I'm pretty interested in trying, seeing how, how that would work. And then uh, the I Do Care In The Zone Pore Tightening Tea Tree Mask. And there's also this Garnier Skin Active Sheet Mask. K 
can't go wrong with masks. Giovanni shampoo and conditioner. There's a coupon. Love me some coupons. Lime Crime Unicorn Hair. Lilu semi permanent color. Ooh, interesting. We got J Manuel Beauty, which I saw him in person and he's so pretty. J Manuel is so freaking gorgeous in person. I was like, blow. I, my breath was like taken away. I was like, dude, he's so pretty. This is by the brand Clay Beyond. And it's the Accuderm Cream Superior Hydration for sensitive skin. Got the Maybelline Brow Precise Volumizing Fiber Volumizer. And then there is also the NYX Love Contours All palette. My sister actually sh opened that up and she showed me hers, which I'm excited about that palette. Almost at the end of the bag, got a couple more things. All right, so I have the Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie. Look how cute this came in with the little tinsel and stuff. Oh, pretty color. This is a really pretty pink. Tammy Taylor Nail Liqueur. Really pretty baby pink. And that is everything in this beauty com bag. So you guys, I definitely feel like I got my money's worth because, wow, I'm super excited. But this is the first time I've actually gone through everything and I'm blown away with how much stuff we ended up getting. Oh my gosh. Now I'm trying to just stuff it all back in here because I have much more to show you guys. And I like this bag, it's huge. I like that it has a zipper on it. Throw like a night bag together if I'm like going somewhere and just take this, cause it's that big. Now I got a bunch of other little bags. At different booths you were able to um, get either free stuff, like you can spin a wheel, depending on which booth you go to, they give you like something free, or they uh, hand out just stuff. If you like take a picture in their photo booth or if you like tag them, follow them on Instagram. And I got a Cantu hair kit. The bag is super cute. I can see myself holding toiletries in here. Got some shea butter, a root relief, a shampoo, conditioner, and moisturizing mask. Extra hold stay gel, moisturizing curl activating cream, cleansing cream shampoo, leave-in conditioner, coconut curling cream and hydrating cream conditioner. Pretty Little Thing booth, which their booth was one of my favorites there. They had like a bunch of different things going on. That's where I got the whole like glitter highlight. If you saw my Instagram, so bomb, so bomb. Like I wanna do that every day. <laughs> but they ended up giving a goodie bag and then this came with like a bodycon dress, which I probably won't wear cause it's kind of big. Like I feel like, look how big the strap is. Like I don't think I'm gonna fit this. It's gonna be way too big. I probably have to tailor it or something. But then again, like the dress is big and I'm a petite girl, so I don't know. We'll see. I haven't even tried it on yet. The bag's cute. Girl, let me tell you what I had to do for Sally's Beauty. Like look at all this free stuff in Sally's Beauty bag, but you had to wait in this massive line, follow them on Instagram, and then you had to post a picture. We didn't really have to wait in the long line because we saw on Saturday everyone's getting these bags and we were just like, we wanted ones. We went to the Sally booth, saw the line wrapped around, we're like, nope, we'll just come back tomorrow when we can get in early and not have to worry about everyone else trying to get the same bag. But the bag is worth it because you have so many things and the bag is super cute. I like the clear Sally's Beauty bag. My sister ended up giving me this bleach, semi-vivid permanent hair color and stuff because she can't use it. Their booth was definitely another favorite because they had a lot going on in their booth as well. I got the um, OPI Iceland Collection, lightning powder, some hair coloring dye, which I just previously showed, Miel Styling Gel, and this is in Honey and Ginger, ooh, Miel Hydrating Conditioner. I need this for my hair. My hair is about, about done. <laughs> The Eden Body Works Mousse for Hair, Antu Moisturizing Cream Activator, Body Lotion in Coconut and Shea, Eden Works Conditioner, Miel Thermal and Heat Protectant Spray, can never go wrong with that, Cantu Coconut Curling Cream, the Clairol 10 Volume Developer, which they gave us two of those, Color Vibrancy Repair Conditioner, Shea Butter for Hair and Body, another Eden Body Wash. Yeah, and then coupons. I need to find a spot for all this because my makeup area is filled to the brim. I have bags surrounding my makeup desk. My husband is probably like, What are you gonna do with all the stuff? Hmm? Where's the guy go? This big LA girl cosmetics bag. There's just a bunch of like random things in here that I got for free from other booths. Also got bags from other booths as well that they're just handing out. Like, 
This Nike one, super cute. Handing out some uh, J Manual beauty bags, which this one's a big bag too. And I like that they're reusable bags because reusable bags, they're very big around this area. We carry them everywhere when we go shopping. And I got a couple of these little LA girl bag. I am thinking when I do my 10k giveaway I'm gonna include a bag so I'm just gonna use them to put all the goodies in. But once we get there we'll talk about it then. And I got an Ardell little lash bag. Better Skin Company was handing out some samples. Got some moisturizer from them. I also got a Sutra heating uh, pad thing for like your curling iron and stuff which I definitely need so I'm super happy that that they were handing that out as little freebies. And Sutra also was giving out some of these hair serums so I got a few of those and I spun the wheel at Moda brushes and got a little contour brush which you never have enough brushes y'all already know. Garnier was handing out some uh, shampoo and conditioners. I got a, a few of these little emulsion collagen things from Nature Republic little Korean brand Derma Doctor hooked it up. I got an agave healing oil treatment. Bioionic was giving out these little cute bags. Yes 2 was giving out little um, facial wipes and they were also giving out these little masks. You like spun the wheel and then it gave you whatever mask the wheel landed on. Peach Slices mask. Giovanni Echo Chic Skin Care. So this is like a detox system. That's going to be interesting to try out. More duo lip balms. Toothpaste from Hello. J Manual Compact Mirror. I also got a full size oil treatment from Agave which Kinda Glaze was giving out little mini nail polishes. Soap and Glory was giving out little pillow plumpers which I have not tried. I heard they're really good. From Real Her, the moisturizing lipstick. This is a different shade than what I got in my beauty com bag so I'm really excited about that. Uh, Koki was also giving out nail polishes and I got a really pretty like nudish shade. Got some headphones. I also got the LA Girl Lip Fi Stylo Creamy Lipstick. If you took a picture in their booth, they handed these out. Deep Cleansing Milk. Just ended up meeting a fellow person that was just walking around, just enjoying BeautyCon. And she was giving these out to like bloggers and stuff. And she saw me with my camera, asked me if I did videos, and of course she's like, let me, let me give you something, got something for you. That is all for all the freebies. <laughs> that we ended up getting. These things that I'm about to show you now is what I ended up buying with my own money. So um, I'm just going to start off with this Wet n Wild bag. They did have a booth there and they were giving out their newest collection that they're about to launch pretty soon. I don't think they've launched it yet. Um, I don't know if they have or not, but I did just do a video on this. The eye look, the highlight, the lip color, all that came from all of these products. I'm, I'm still debating if I want to get it up before this beauty con haul or after the beauty con haul. So if it's already up, I'll have the link down below on my review slash first impression on this. But if it's up later, you'll see it later. So make sure that your notification bell is on so you can keep a lookout on that. And I go through all the products and I show you what's good, let you guys know what I like and don't like about it. I ended up getting a good deal on that. I think like it retails for 50 something I am getting it for like $29.99 which is not bad at all. This is just a BH cosmetic bag but I just kind of grouped it all from different brands on what I bought. I ended up getting quite a few red cherry lashes. Um, I have an, another Berkley but I went through those that are sitting in my little case of um, lashes that I've already used but these are the Berkley ones which are gorgeous. Then you have the Wispies, then the Mary Jane, and then the Molly. And if you spend a certain amount, you got eyelash glue, which I did not even realize I had eyelash glue in my beauty comp bag because I didn't go through it, but it is what it is. I can just add that in my kit. I went to um, LA Girl Cosmetics, like you guys have seen, and I got a few of the pro um, coverage foundations. So I got one for myself, which she swatched me, and I was warm beige, so... That is my shade. And then I ended up going back the next day and I ended up getting the lightest shade, a medium shade, and a dark shade just to put in my kit. You can never have enough foundations for your kit. I got these uh, Ultimate Lip Intense Stay Auto Liners. So they're lip liners. I uh, ended up getting, I keep it spicy and I forever bare. Also got 
a set of brushes from BH Cosmetics, which I kind of want to do a video on these brushes. So like this video, let me know if you guys want to see a, a video on these brushes. i um, kind of like use them all and we'll just go through them and see how, how it ends up. Then the last things I bought was these two palettes. They are from the brand Pinky Rose and they're gl pressed glitter palette. And I ended up getting both because I obviously couldn't decide and I was like, you know what, YOLO, I'm here, let's just do it. They had a good deal going on. So I ended up getting the bright color. The one that I just showed you was not the bright colors. Those were like the neutral colors. These ones other bright colors and if you bought both the palettes you get the smackdown glue for them i feel like you don't really need but i'm gonna play with it and see how it works they also included a pressed shadow and drama a burgundy very very pretty oh my gosh that is it Whew. that's a lot of stuff i didn't want to keep you guys waiting around being like okay this bitch over here just keeps talking and she won't stop so that's everything. I had such an amazing time. I feel like I'm gonna go back next year because it was that much fun. I definitely recommend it. If you guys have never been to BeautyCon and want to go, do it. If you can do it, do it. And I do have a vlog that will be up by the time you watch this video and it'll be the previous video but I'll have the link down below of both days at BeautyCon. I guess that's everything I need to say. Like this video if you enjoyed watching and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I would greatly appreciate it. Let's get to 10k quick guys and if you want to keep in touch with me via other social media sites I will list my Twitter my Facebook page my Instagram my snapchat and my other vlogging channel around this area so definitely go check that out and I'll have all the links down below as well thank you so much for watching I'll see you in my next video bye